Hey, my Tauruses, it's Sunny Avi, and I'm here to do your reading just to see what's going on with the energies. Keep in mind that these are generals. The things that I talk about may not resonate with you and it should be all right. If you are interested in a personal reading, please check out the description bar below because my information is there. Disclaimer with my readings, I do talk fast, I do curse, and do see me reading for a lot of different energies. My readings may be pretty jumpy. Um, I feel for some of you, something may be trying to get your attention during this time. Rather, it's in a spiritual or the physical realm. Some of you guys, um, you may be seeing snakes. Rather, you're seeing them out and about in nature, or you're seeing them on social media, or you're seeing them in your dreams. Uh, depending upon, like, if you dream of snakes, depending upon, okay, if the, if the snake tries to attack you, then this is enemies coming your way. But if you see a snake just randomly um, and it doesn't bother you, I see it as healing, transformation. Um, if you see a bright colored snake, um, th there may be some negative things that will happen. So just be mindful of like warning something, maybe warning you, okay? Um, some of you guys, you may be interested uh, working with uh, St. Martha or St. Martha La Dominadora. Um, yeah, um, it just depends which one you wanna work with. Um, there's this little bird. It just keeps chirping the same little tune. And I thought it was so sweet. Alrighty, so I'm going to be reading some tarot cards that I created. And this card popped out. New lover slash flame. So maybe you guys, um, you may find a new lover doing this time, honey. Rather, it's good or negative. Okay. Um, love is in the air. I am picking up for some of you. Maybe you're working with, um, Aphrodite. Um, Cupid, apples, nectar. If if you want to attract love, work work with those elements, and also like the the element of water. Um, but just be mindful of your intentions with the element of water, because you don't want love to flow out of your life. Um, but you do want love to flow and be forever lasting. So just be mindful if you are getting like a source of water. Um, from like a river or a stream or whatever the case would be. Just make sure it ain't going to ever run dry. Okay. Um, but maybe for some of you, um, you encounter new, new love. All righty. Just don't be foolish and just honor yourself and everything that you want. Oh, some may popped out too. So yeah, some of y'all, you may be meeting love during this time. Now, honey, just because you come in contact with us, don't make doesn't mean that that it's always going to be perfect okay this person may have to change you may have to change for this person and vice versa to to be good okay it's a work in progress but maybe some of you you may be lucky and the stars and the heavens and what the, the cosmos opened up for you and you found good love so that's very exciting very very exciting for you guys okay smile again so this love may may help you smile again but please just trust everything listen to the universe listen to your spirit listen to what this motherfucker is saying don't put words in folks mouths don't put what you want this person to do and say don't 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 do all that let this person be their true self please all right just be mindful about that some of y'all you may be doing love magic during this time um, try not to do love magic on a particular person. Try not. Um, yeah, just, you know, just, if you want love, just ask for love in the most authentic way. Okay. But, um, yeah, maybe you guys, maybe you are already in a relationship and maybe you feel that this person is a soulmate. Maybe they truly are. And maybe you guys, you know, you got to work together. Like I said in the beginning, um, you know, maybe you need to do things to make this person smile again, vice versa, okay? Personal style. Maybe some of you guys, you need to change your style during this time. Maybe you want to uh, change your style. I am picking up that this will be a good time to go shopping. Just don't, um, you know, just don't go overboard, okay? I don't know what's going on with Venus, but I keep picking up on, like, Venus energy. And you guys um, are ruled by the planet Venus. So maybe you're feeling that energy. Damn, my leg. Okay. Be mindful of legs during this time. Next, we have uh, secret child, children, open fields. Okay. Um, be, be mindful of um, outside children. 
Rather, it's yours. You find out that your mate has children, um, or you find out, or you're finding out that somebody in the family has secret children during this time. Okay, just try to keep that controlled. Um, in regards to open fields, <sighs> child, just just go with the flow. Just, but respect yourself. Okay, um, when I say go with the flow, just take it easy. Don't don't try to force shit too much. Just let it let it out in the universe let your divine god and angels know what you want but don't keep doing it don't keep doing it don't keep doing it like things will happen in divine timing okay on another note maybe for some of you you know you need to be open to meeting new people and you know letting new opportunities and whatever the case may be come your way and maybe maybe you will find that soulmate you will find a new love again but just y'all please because I I know like when I'm saying this, I know some people may, may be like, oh my god, I'm gonna be I'm gonna meet love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's but it's like you guys gotta be open. Like you ain't gonna find love sitting on your couch. Maybe you do with these damn dating websites. But you just gotta be open. You got to be open. And just don't be naive and gullible and just throw yourself out there, please. <laughs> Next we got Ronisha's honey. And no offense to anybody named Ronisha. And um, Aquarius, some of you guys be mindful of insects coming in your home, mainly roaches, okay? I know that there's a symbolic thing for roaches, but we don't give a damn. We don't want them in nobody's home, okay? You don't wish that on your worst enemy. If you do, you do. If you don't, you don't. Um, or maybe, you know, you're, you're just noticing like a lot of like naysayers and another word for haters, okay? Uh, some of you guys, you may be interacting with an Aquarius, during this time. Uh, rather, this Aquarius will be your lover. Now, when you meet people, honey, just because you meet an Aquarius, that don't mean that that motherfucker gonna be your soulmate, okay? Maybe it will, but once again, be open. Be open. Understand what this person is saying. Don't put words in this motherfucker's mouth, okay? I just want y'all to move with caution, okay? Um, maybe some of you guys, you have Aquarius in your chart. Uh, maybe for some of you, this will be a good time for you to just... Um, be fair and listen to both sides of the story. Maybe you need to have an understanding of people during this time and, you know, being aware of where they come from and their goals within life and how they view the future. Okay. This will be a great time for a lot of you guys to, um, uh, try to find a business partner during this time, or maybe some of you guys, you're thinking about getting a business partner. Um, yeah. That's what I'm picking up on. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed this return. Good luck with everything. And I shall see you guys next video. Take care. Bye.